poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Pac Man. You and Pac World, Pac Nation, stand up. And look, man, if you have not already, go and enter the month of September giveaway. We're giving away a free $50 Visa gift card. And the rules are you have to subscribe to this channel. You have to go and find me on Instagram at Pac World Kicks. Follow me on Instagram. Then you find this picture right here. Underneath of that, comment done and tag two friends. And as a bonus, if we get 100 people to enter that giveaway, I will be doubling that prize. So instead of one, we'll be giving away two free $50 Visa gift cards. So, man, tell a friend to tell a friend, man, enter that giveaway so you can have a chance to win. I want everybody to win. But we're only gonna pick one or two winners. So do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Then hit that notification bell so you receive all the dope content that we drop on Head Pack World Kicks. And drop a like on this jump one time for your boy. And I know you see the title, I know you see the thumbnail. So let's jump right into it. We have a delayed W. We won't take L's over here at Pack World Kicks. We just have delayed W. If we really want a sneaker, we're going to get it. Just give it a little time. We're going to wait on the price to get where we wanted to go. Then we'll reach back and snatch it. But I had to go back and get this right here. This right here is a sneaker that I really, really, really wanted. And on release day, I took the L. I took the L. Just like today with that Fragment 3. Your boy took the L. Now, that sneaker right there, I don't know if I'm going to go back and get that one or not. It's about like the Off-White 4. If I got it, I got it. I really wanted it for retail, but if I didn't, I ain't going to lose no sleep. But this right here, I need to have. So, we got that all-over gray Jordan 1 box with that metallic Nike right here on the top and on the sides. And the label reads Air Jordan 1 High OG COJP. The color is neutral gray and metallic silver. And there you go right there. My pair right here came from Cross Seas. So as you can see, it don't have the USD tag right there on the front. But these was 170 when they dropped. You know your boy had to pay that resale. You got a stamp right there, the lot number, and the top of the lid. Then we got that Jordan 1 that paper right here. And you have, I don't know if you can see that, you got the Jordan symbol. You have 2001 to 2020. Yeah. Any more stickers, stamps, anything in the box? Yep. Got that green sticker right there in the box also. And there you have it with the box. And without further ado, bah! Damn! Woo! This is that Jordan 1 High OG. Japan at Tokyo. And these right here are fire. These are the Jordan 1 Tokyos. Japan. Tokyo. I don't know. They see OJP, which means Japan, but they call these the Jordan 1 Tokyo. So, but just out of first glance, these are fire. Ooh. From the new buck to the to the leather, everything on the sneaker is. Yeah. Even the tongue, I like that too. But we jump, we get into that. We do the review. I'll let y'all know 
I had to cop my pair off of Stock X. Like I said, your boy took the L on release day, so I couldn't cop them. But I had to go back and secure that W. So if you want to, right now is a good time to buy them if you're trying to get them for resale because the price is not so high right now. This sneaker will go up over time. This sneaker will go up a lot. So if you want to get them right now, it's the perfect time to cop for resale. If you wait, you're going to pay. But let's jump right into that review. We have that all over neutral gray bottom, which I like because even when you wear these, they won't get so dirty. Like if it was a white bottom, extremely dirty. But we have an all white midsole. And then the upper is made out of that. Everybody was calling a suede, but it's like a new buck and a leather. And then you have that neutral gray all over on the panels, the heel collar, wrapping the toe, come up on the eye stays. And then you have that metallic silver on the toe box on the wings the back the back heel and on the swoosh and then you have that jordan one that's underneath for that that jordan wings and underneath for that plastic piece right there and one of the dopest things about the sneaker the tongue doesn't have that the little piece right that says nike air the nike air is embroidered in the actual tongue and this tongue, tumble leather on this tongue is, this is some good leather on this tongue right here. And then you have like a neoprene behind the tongue and in the sock liner as well. You got some, some rope style gray laces. And then you have on the insole, you have a gray insole with that metallic COJP with that Jordan logo. And behind the tongue, we have some black tab, red jump man with 20, 2001 to 2020. And this sneaker came out in 2001 and in 2001, this sneaker was not that sought after. But due to everything that's going on right now, the 2020 pair flew. Like people were saying this sneaker was sitting and all that stuff back in 2001. And the sneaker was real limited back then too. But this sneaker game was just not like it is right now. You know, with everything going on, people got time to sit at home and do nothing but cop sneakers. Sneakers, are just, no sneakers safe. Everything sold out, sold out, so sold, sold out, sold out, sold out, sold out. Everything selling out. But these right here, I see why these sold out. The sneaker is fire. So comment down below. Tell me what y'all think. Is this a sneaker you went after? Is it one you just didn't even want to bother with? Or you had to do like I did. You had to go and get that delayed W. But let's jump right now to a little on foot. Then we'll jump right back in front of the camera to end the video off. All
boop. And there you have it, man. The Air Jordan 1 Tokyo. And these are fire. Like I said, from the material and just the simple simplicity, simplicity of the colorway. Like everything's just simple, plain, but it's well put together. Like from just the material they chose and this shoe is fire. And I can see over time, this sneaker will be going for a lot of money. So like I said, you can grab it now while the price is down. I would highly suggest you do so. Because within the next year or so, you will not be able to get these for a decent price. You have to break a bag on it. But comment down below. Let me know what y'all think. Or is it something you just don't you don't like if it is and if you made this fun the video i need y'all to do me a favor man comment down below and let me know what's your next pickup like my next pick i'm really i'm really looking forward to is that jordan one high og patent leather black and gold that's my next cop i want the dark mochas but not as much as i want the black and gold and then after that I got to go for the 25th anniversary 11s. But let me know what some sneakers y'all want to cop. And let me know what y'all think of these. Some you rocking with, some you not. Did you cop or did you not? But there you have it, man. We have the Jordan 1 High OG Tokyo, a.k.a. the COJPs. And... You a pack man, you a pack world, pack nation, stand up. And man, hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, and please do me a favor and drop a like on this jump for the one time for your boy. But y'all know our model over here. Stay blessed, stay prayed up, stay safe out there. Peace.